team folders can help centralize file collaboration. While user-managed shared folders are great for one-off collaborations, team folders are company-managed and IT-controlled, which means only admins can invite new groups to those folders. Admins can also set granular permissions for anyone on the team. Let's check out Lights on Travel's Finance Team folder to see how nested shared folders work. Within the Finance Team folder, there are several shared folders that are shared with everyone in the Finance group, and Mike has set granular permissions for each one. So what does that mean? If we take a look at the Invoices shared folder, we can see that it's not only shared with the Finance group, but it's also shared with several other company groups like HR and IT. If Mike wants to add more groups or individuals to any shared folder, he can easily do just that. Let's say the finance team is working with a contractor on an invoices project. Mike has the option of giving the contractor either editing or viewing permissions of the folder's content. Mike can easily manage how teams collaborate outside of Lights on Travel too. Let's say that he wants to ensure that his company's financial data can only be shared internally. Mike can manage the finance folder's access permissions to ensure that Lights on Travel's data is only shared with people in Lights on Travel.